Right guys, today I'm going to detect this permission has an old track that appears on the it appears on old old maps there's a track that runs up to the mansion it's not a footpath it's a like a track for horses and carriages and stuff it's it's been filled in kind of now but it runs this way so i'm going to detect all the way up and to either side of it today uh, because obviously a track means people things flying out their pockets when they're on horses all that sort of stuff so that's what we're going to do today we're going to do up this track you can sort of just see see that little v-shaped dip there that's it uh, but they filled the rest of it in um, we'll see how we get on right there we go it's a tag of some sort and it says I think a 995 or some such thing it might be a cow tag or yeah some sort of animal tag i think look at the size of the horns on these guys imagine getting oh hello buddy imagine getting dunted by that keep my distance i think right guys look at this did i get excited or not is this gold? It feels so light. It's dead light. I don't know if that's gold or what. What what even is that? Part of a part of a bracelet, I think. Oh man. Right, so so what? What now? Have I found my first ever gold object or is that just Oh man? It feels so light, I'm not sure that is gold. It's probably not. <gasps> oh, come on, what do I do? I'll just have to wait until this video goes up and you can tell me what you think. I'm not sure if it is gold. It's, it's too light and it's just a bit, a bit too sort of, it just doesn't seem quite right. Oh, don't do this to me. Right, let's kid on. For now, that's gold. I'll take that. I've found my first ever gold. Yay! Wow! <laughs> oh, whatever it is, it's a nice thing to find anyway. I thought it was a ring pool. What's it coming up? Hmm. Let me know, guys. Let me know what you think about that. And the very next signal is a ring pool. Right guys, I'm not sure if that's part of a lead bag seal. Or some other sort of token type thing. Seems to be blank on that side and then this side it's got like a, an N or a Z on it. So I'll get the, get the toothbrush out and I'll brush its teeth. See if we can figure out what this is. By the way, I do appreciate all the people that take time out to to tell me in the comments all the things that I don't know. There's people that they just know somebody knows something about everything basically. Even for example in the last video, the light bulb fixture. Somebody was able to tell me exactly the kind of light bulb, the history behind it. It's it is very useful. It's very kind. So, can you do the same with this, please? <laughs> That's funny. That's the second one of these we've found today. I'm going for definitely some sort of animal tag. Right guys, another coin that's trashed. Such a shame because you just know if that was in good condition, that would that would be a really nice coin. An old, old coin. Right guys, I've got a signal that sounds okay and it's not too deep so we won't be faffing about for ages. So I'm going to do a live dig. Oh, 
there's a big stone under there. <laughs> That's typical. Huge big stone. Right, I'll bring you closer. Hate that sound. Oh, what actual what? It's a tube of bloody tube of something. Oh well, I'll try that again another time. Hey right, guys, we're bang smack in the middle of this old track, and I think we've got silver. I think. Well, I hope we do now that I've said that. Where is it? I just saw something silver coloured. Oh, there it is. Can you see that? Probably not. I'm not sure, but anyway. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, that is definitely silver of some description. Let's turn it over. Oh, it's a shilling. And I don't think I've ever found one of those. 1946, so what, that'll be 50% silver. Oh, God, this is brilliant. Yeah, I think that's 50% silver. 1946 shilling. First ever shilling, I think. Okay, let's do a live dig. Look at that plug. A beautiful plug. Of course it's not out at the first go though. Oh, 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 it is! Oh, oh, oh! It's a coin, but I don't think it's... Oh, I think it's just a modern penny. What a shame. It is. Oh well, at least it's not a tube of toothpaste. Hey guys, look at this. That's a nice little thing. A little piece of jewellery of some description. I'm not sure if that's silver. Uh, I don't think it is. I don't. I don't know what it is. It's, I thought for a minute it was a cat badge, but it's, that's definitely not a cat badge. It's a little, uh, little badge. Oh well. A little bit, a little bit different from usual anyway. What, what is that supposed, what is it supposed to be? Is that half? It looks like half of the crown. To me. Half of the royal crown. Oh well. Next signal is a trashed pen knife. I think that's the third third one I've had out of this permission. Right guys, we've either got I'm not sure if this is a love token or just a, a bent ancient coin. Hold on, let me get out the sunshine. Because I have had a, a love token off of this permission, if you remember. Oh, it looks bent. Looks deliberately bent there. 
Oh, I think it is. I think that's the second. No. Third. Look at that. Yes. Love token. <laughs> oh, yes. Oh God, that is fantastic. I think that's what it is. I might be getting excited over nothing, but... Come on, it looks like it, eh? Now, the last one that I found, there was three of them. I'm ashamed to say I lost one. The other one had nothing on it apart from the initials AC. But they, I was told they were William the Third Silvers or something. Is that what this is? Is this silver? Doesn't look it. Oh, brilliant. When I get home, I'll see if I can get something off it. I didn't... Uh, I didn't see the initials AC on the other one until I got home and cleaned it properly. Oh, this, this, this permission is blowing my brains out. This is a love token, isn't it? I don't want to work. I don't want to go back to work. I just want to be a full-time metal detectorist. I don't need much. All I need is a tent and some food and batteries for my detector. <laughs> a love token and a cartwheel and potential gold all in one morning. Love it. Right guys, we've got another coin in there. Oh, this sun is very bright. Oh, nice. A one penny from 1921. I feel sorry for these sheep. Look at them, they're all trying to hide under the trees. With their big woolly jumpers on. <laughs> <coughs> anyway, another coin, and it is a half penny. Not a ship's half penny, just a half penny. 1911, I think it is. Quite nice. I think some of the small coins that are completely trashed that I find sometimes might be these. They're the right sort of size. There we go, big fat musket ball. That is a big one actually. Look at the size of that. What is that? If it's a coin, I've never seen a coin like that. I'm wondering if it's some sort of token. It looks, there's a five there, it looks like a ship on the front, I think. And then on the back, I can't, can't quite make out the words, but they'll be... Nah, I'll have to have a proper look at that in a minute, but... It's something I've never seen before, that's for sure. See if I can... Nineteen seventy-one, does that say? Nineteen seventy-one, so that's not a British coin anyway, if it is a coin. I have a feeling the clue will be in the words going around the side, so let's go and sit down and have a look. Interesting stuff, never seen that before in my life. Right guys, I've been doing a little bit of research. This is a coin from Cyprus. 1970... I'm guessing 1971. Uh, so that's what it is, five, I think it's five mils. Uh, Years ago, I found a coin that I think was two mils, and that was from Palestine. But, yep, that's what it is. Coin from Cyprus. We're getting everything here, all nationalities in this little place. I cannot believe it. Another light bulb. I don't know, maybe someone was using them for target practice. To shoot at? I don't know. Right, here's one for the viewers. Guys in the comments, what is that? It's made of metal, obviously. Um, 
no idea. I hope somebody knows. Hey guys, first button of the day, I believe. I think that's a button anyway. Certainly looks like one. Nothing on the front. Is that a button? I think it is. Right guys, look at this. Big fat thing. What do you think that could be? Now is that a cartwheel this time or is that another one of these Russian Copex? Oh, I can see the little... Yeah, I think that's a cartwheel. Nice, now that... That'll be my first one. If it is. Oh, wow, look at that. It is, it's a cartwheel. Oh, gorgeous. Right, I need to try and do this some justice. The sunshine makes it so I can't really see what you're seeing. Can you see that? <laughs> oh, that's nice. That's going to clean up all right, actually, that side. I'm not going to rub it, but you can just see the... Now, where's the date on these things? It's going to be 1700, isn't it? Oh, fantastic. So that's my first confirmed cartwheel coin. God, I hope you can see this. <laughs> what a beast. Oh God, that is such a nice thing to find. Now that was deep. That was a deep signal and it was coming up. It sounded like Sounded like it was going to be iron, if I'm honest with you. And when it was deep, I thought, that is going to be iron. Oh, there you go. You see? People are right. Just dig everything. What can you say? There are no words left to describe this. Another coin and it's the first one of these today. Ships half buried, 1956 I think that is. Right, this was giving a pretty solid sound like it was a coin but... I've totally just gone and jinxed it by doing this. out here somewhere. Where are you, buddy? It's in here. Oh, ooh, I was right. It is a coin. So that's another uh, half penny. We dug a lot today, by the way. I don't know how. I must have been going full blast, but there's all the junk. Tons of the stuff. I'm not sure what that is, I've got that down as junk. Uh, that, I thought maybe a ball of silver. It's not, it's just molten aluminium or something. So, yeah, tons of junk. And the good stuff. Well, some animal tags there. Put those to one side. Little front end of a toy truck. A pen knife. Like I said, third or fourth one I've got off this little permission. Uh, an absolute beast of a musket ball. And what I think is a impacted one. And I've had a closer look at this. I think... I think I was right. I think that is a cat badge. Half of one. Uh, and it looks to me like a, a royal crest of some sort. Could be wrong, it could be a piece of jewellery or something, but that's my guess. Uh, 
<laughs> the weirdest coin I've ever found from Cyprus. Can only imagine what it's doing in a field in uh, Scotland. But we have found Russian, so uh, the silver, fifty percent silver, I think it is. We're doing well with silver. I've had silver every hunt for the last month, I think. Uh, I've jinxed it now, I shouldn't have said that. Uh, a button. There's really not much on there. I think that's a button anyway. Uh, a, a modern penny. Now this. See what this is. I'll give you a second, see if you can guess. Hold on, maybe it's easier if I turn it this way. What do you think those are? I'll tell you what I think they are, right? I think those are little feet. One foot, two foot, with five little toes on each foot. And I think that was a little bracelet or something. And apparently, the Victorians liked putting bracelets on their children and stuff. So that's my guess. I think those are baby feet for a little baby's bracelet. It's probably definitely not gold. But it's still a really nice little piece of jewellery. Uh, if I'm wrong, please correct me. Bag seal. It's either an N, a Z or a 2, I think. Uh, by the way, I don't think I filmed this. Uh, and I'll, I didn't film it because I thought it was just a chunk of lead like I dig up all the time. But look at that. Look at that. Three X's on it, so what what would that be? My, my only guess is some sort of trade weight, some sort of weight. And the X's are sort of to tell them how much it weighs. That's a pure guess. If anyone's seen anything like that before, please leave a comment. The car wheel. Really faded, really trashed, but what I'll do, I'll stick a picture of what these should look like for everybody to see. And I believe, I could be wrong, I think these were only minted for one year. 1797, I think. So fairly rare. And a really nice thing to find. And a love token, another love token off of this place. Don't think it's uh, a silver coin. But you can definitely see the S shape there. Brilliant. Dead happy with that. Until I went on to this permission, I had never ever found one of these before. And now I've found three or four. Uh, not a clue what that is. And then, three pennies. I think the earliest was early 1900s. Uh, this which I thought was a, a really trashed 50 pence because it looks like it's got eight sides to it but I'm really, I really don't think that's what it is now. So does anyone have any idea on coins that had eight sort of sides? Uh, another toasted coin and then three half pennies, again the earliest early 1900s and that was us guys I had a really good day silver, love token, cartwheel jewellery, cat badge this, whatever this is coins couldn't ask for any more right, now I need to go and see if I can actually physically upload such a big video I've had problems in the past which are why mine are always short wish me luck I actually, if it does upload, I hope you all make it this far, <laughs> you might be bored. Anyway, okay, see you next time, cheers. Please, please leave comments about all the things I'm not sure about, by the way, it helps out.